All right, as you can probably see here, we got a huge bulk return from PSA. So I sent this out August 2020 through uh, Graded Gem, which is like a middleman service for sending in your cards. And it took over a year to get these back. So I'm very excited. Um, I have like a general idea of what I sent, but obviously it's been so long that I might, you know, be surprised with some of the stuff I pull out of here. So let's get into it and check out what we have. Guess we'll just start with this stack. Whew. So, oh, that's pretty cool. XY Evolutions Mewtwo. So for these, there's like a lot of vintage, modern, Japanese, English. So there's like a lot of different variation here. It's going to be pretty cool. So this, PSA 9, eh, not bad. Another 9. For like the lower value stuff or like nothing crazy, I'll probably just go through them quick. Oh, this could be big. Mega Charizard EX. Nine. Okay. Hopefully we see a 10 here. Oh, this is another one that could be huge. Oh, an eight. Oh, yeah, that's very off-centered. And it's got a bit of whitening, so makes sense. PSA 8, pretty cool. So it looks like we're in the evolutions part. Yep. Nine. Another nine. Okay. Another nine. Another nine. Come on. Can we see a ten here? A wick, so some burning shadows. A nine. Kiawe. Another nine. Wishy washy. Oh, yeah, these are the secrets from uh, Cosmic Eclipse. These are really cool. Nine. Mimikyu. Nine. Whew. I don't know. This is uh, starting to hurt a bit. Nine. Piplup. Nine. Man, I thought these were really nice when I sent them. Still, nine's a great grade. You know, very high. Oh, these are from the Hidden Fates uh, Premium Collection. I sent in the full set of those. There it is. PSA 10. Very cool. So these all came from the same box. I just opened one box and sent all the cards. Yep, 10. So hopefully this one, this next one, hopefully this is a 10 because this one's huge. There it is, all, all 10s, we got the set. That is really nice. Let's hate that. Okay, so we haven't been getting too destroyed yet. Shining Rayquaza from Shining Legends. Eight. <laughs> this next card, I already know what it is because uh, Z and G, if you watch him, he showed this one off. But this is huge. So we got the Legendary Treasures Charizard. And it got a PSA 10. That is such a nice card. Wow. I can't believe that got a 10. I actually opened this from a pack. So I bought one pack on eBay, and I guess it got the 10. That is nuts. Okay, move those. Oh, we're getting into the Mewtwo's. So a lot of these are from my personal collection. These are such cool cards. This one's from uh, Majestic Dawn. Eight. 
Oh, that's such a beautiful card. This is probably my second favorite Mewtwo art, as weird as that sounds. Six. Wow, that's a really nice six. Huh. I'll have to inspect that further, but this card looks really nice for a six. Maybe there's like some hidden damage I didn't see. This one, I actually know exactly what this is. I thought it might have been damaged at PSA because I was cert hopping for a couple of these just to check. I mean, you can see this card, right? It's, it's not perfect. There's like a little bit of whitening. But overall, it's not bad. It's a pretty good condition card. And PSA 1. Yeah. I don't know what's up with that, but I definitely don't agree with that grade. But whatever. That one hurts. I thought this was going to be like at least a 7. So... PSA 1. Oh, I guess we're back on to some uh, hidden fades. So the order on this is probably messed up because I'm doing it backwards, but... 10. Okay. 9. 9. We might have seen that. 9. These are all pretty low value stuff, so I'll try to rapid fire through them. 9. Nine. Nine. I wasn't really an expert when I sent these because obviously that was a while ago, so. Oh, there's a 10. So there's probably going to be like a lot of eights and nines. But hopefully, also a lot of tens. Oh, I like this guy. It's definitely staying in the collection. I think I sent in like two or three of these. Oh, a nine. Yep, there's another one. Ten. Very cool. Another ten. Another ten. A nine. Nine. And... Oh, ten. I love this card. Alolan Vulpix. I think I have the, um... What's it called? Alolan Ninetales at PSA right now still. So hopefully we get a ten on that to have the set. That would be really cool. Alright. Move those. Next stack. Oh, it's kind of random. Darkness Ablaze. Okay. So, Scizor VMAX. Aw, oh, Mint 9. The Rainbow one. Oh, PSA 10. That's such a cool card. I wish we got the set, but we'll take that. Oh, if you can see that, we got some Japanese. These should be good. Yeah, look at that. Sabrina's Gengar. That is a really nice card. Oh, a seven. I'm going to have to go through these later, but I don't know. That looks really nice for a seven. Try and move my head out of there so you can see just the card. Hmm. Okay. Oh, the Slow King. That is such a beautiful card, too. PSA 9. Nice. That's really solid. Nope, oh, Heracross. No, nothing too crazy, but still pretty cool. 8. Oh, that's another big boy right there. Typhlosion, 
five. <sighs> I kind of assumed that. I pulled this from a pack, and I think it had like a ding right here from being the first card in the pack, so not bad. Ooh, Jolteon. PSA 9. I got this card for $3. So that is huge. I won this in some random auction that looked super scratched in the top loader. But the card looked really clean. So, PSA 9. Oh, back to the Mewtwo's. These are huge. So we got Vending Series 3. Oh, that is nice. Mint 9. Wow, I love these cards. Mewtwo is my favorite Pokemon, if you didn't know. So, there's going to be a lot of really cool Mewtwo's in here. Mint 9. Very cool. Oh, the 10th movie collection promo. This is a really cool card. Mint 9. Nice. I actually bought all these Japanese ones from a single guy. It was all one collection. And I thought they looked really clean. So, Mewtwo half deck. Six. Hey, right when I'm saying they looked really clean. There must be like some damage I didn't notice. But that's such a cool card either way. Look at that shatter foil. Oh, this is such a cool card. So this is from the Japanese version of Pokemon Rumble. So I'm trying to move my finger a bit. Melee Pokemon Scramble. Gem Mint 10. I've been looking at the pop for this for the past like year. So this is only a pop 14. And I'm really happy to have one. So this was one I already knew was coming because... There was only two 10s and one 8 graded in like the past six months. So I knew there's no way mine got an 8. Wow, that is really nice. Oh, LVX Mewtwo Level X. Oh, Gem Mint 10. That is really nice. Oh, hold on, I'm getting a call that what a beautiful card man i love this card oh base set so japanese base set mewtwo psa 7 i don't know i thought this one looked pretty clean but psa 7 is still a pretty high grade definitely can't complain about that this this is my one favorite card. My favorite Mewtwo card and possibly my favorite Pokemon card. So hopefully we see a good grade here. Mint 9, ah. That's still really good. Really hoping for the 10 on that, but honestly, we'll take a Mint 9. I don't know why, there's something about like just that like kind of edgy look. I don't know how to explain it, but this is my favorite Mewtwo card. Very nice. Oh, Rockets Mewtwo, Japanese. Mint 9, take that. Expedition, first edition. This is a hollow. 8, oh man. Oh yeah, that corner is like a little bent up. Okay. Legend Awakened, 7, okay. And Majestic Dawn, another one, 8, okay. Not bad, not bad. We will take that. <sighs> I think most of these now, there's a few like vintage, but for the most part, yeah, Hidden Fates, there's going to be a ton of Hidden Fates in here. 9, so we'll try to rapid fire through these. Oh. And right when I say that, we get a Holland Phantoms Reverse Hollow. These are so cool. These are probably my favorite Reverse Hollows. Eight. It's pretty good. 
we will definitely take like eights and nines on these because they're so old and like people didn't really these were like worthless so people didn't really keep them in good condition seven we'll take that another deoxys seven i think i have the other ones too yep oh eight take that Oh, Staff Fion. This is an interesting card. And it got a five. Okay. Hmm. I don't know why that got a five. I'll have to check it out later. But, okay. Oh, that's a big boy. Venusaur from base set. If you can see right here, there's a huge crease in it. So I was not expecting much. Yeah, VG3. <laughs> Still, that's a beautiful looking card for a display. So I should have the Blastoise as well. That might be next. Yep. EX5. We'll take that. I thought this was going to be a 6, so pretty close. The fronts of both of these, though, are really nice. So that's why I got them graded. Either way, it's still a very beautiful card. Oh, Zapdos from Fossil. Seven. Hey, not bad. A lot of these I just bought like random singles on eBay, like auctions for super cheap. So definitely can't complain with these uh, lower grades. Oh, no symbol. So that just means there's no jungle symbol in the corner. Three. <laughs> Man, they were pretty brutal on these... Uh, Older cards. First edition Machamp. This is the shadowed one. Five. Man. I knew these were like not perfect condition, but I thought they'd be decent. Half decent. Like sets, like sevens maybe. No, this one I knew was not going to get a good grade. So the hollow was super scratched up, but I'm like, yeah, I'll just send it in for 10 bucks, whatever. Yeah, five. Ooh, Dark Hypno, first edition. That's a very cool card. Four, man. <laughs> Zashi and V. Mint nine. Oh, I think I showed that. Quick ball. PSA 10. Very cool. Mew V, Darkness of Blaze. PSA 10. Oh, here's another Scizor. There it is. We finished the set. Cool. Very cool. And the final stack. Now this is definitely all 100% hidden fate, so I'll just try to go through it quick. Mint 9. PSA 10. Wow. I love this card. It's so, uh... I mean, I know there's a lot of these out there, but I still really like that card. Mint 9. Mint 9. Oh, Giovanni's Exile, PSA 10. Jesse and James, PSA 10. Another 10. Another 10. Oh, that's actually a huge card. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. So, Charmeleon, PSA 10. Oh, <laughs> we got the matching one. Charmander, Charmeleon, both PSA 10s. Those are actually worth a good amount of money still. So we will take those. Naganadel, I don't even know how to say that. I just sent in whatever shinies I had, sent them all. Mint 9 Electrode. Mint 9 Nihelgo. Mint 9 Reshiram. Can we see some 10s? Ooh. <laughs> oh, that is a nice one. Out of those last, like, full arts, this is definitely the coolest one to get. So Lucario, OG Pokemon, really cool. I played him a lot when he came to uh, Smash Bros. I think it was, yeah. Aw, oh, Mint 9 on the Glaceon. And the last card. Boom. Eight. <laughs> Not a great way to end it off, but we did have some really huge cards in there. So, like, this... 
you know, that's a really big one. This. And then, where are those Mewtwo's? Oh yeah, this. I'm gonna have to figure out what's up with that because that should not be a one. Yeah, go over that. All my Mewtwo's, really happy with those. Oh, here it is. So that's a huge card too. That's Pop 14. So yeah, show those. 